glad you brought this up yes. then because <laughs> earlier this week in the New York Post, there was an article. Uh, the adulterous site, uh, Ashley Madison, I know you guys never heard of it. They're expecting a massive, I'm talking 500% spike in signups from women the day after Mother's Day. Now, the article actually quoted one woman whose cheapsake husband last year got her a greeting card, right, rather than jewelry or flowers. And, well, her name was Ann, and she said, quote, opening the Mother's Day card last year from my husband, Derek, my heart sank. We've been married for more than 15 years, and I was the mom of his two young children. <laughs> But he hadn't even Please. thought to buy me flowers, <laughs> oh, let alone jewelry. Dr. Robbie, is that enough to cheat on your husband? <gasps> no. That, by the way, <laughs> that is a but, convenient right. excuse Dude, to cheat yeah, on your husband. And, and, and let's just say, listen, anger is probably one of the leading reasons why people cheat at all. But it, clearly cheating is about trying to get something that you're not getting in your primary mm. relationship. So this woman felt like her husband so wasn't the recognizing her romantic So that's the final straw, out. then. Could that be the final straw of something but, that's been building up for a long but time? But let me just tell you, yes. But another woman could feel like, wow, the card was so thoughtful, it meant so much right. to me. So I don't buy that it was just the card. It was probably a, what that card meant to her. And so obviously mind, not a lot. So you sound not like you're justifying <laughs> it a little bit. I'm not justifying it. A little cheating. bit, just a little bit. All I'm saying is we have to <laughs> understand what triggers different people and when people or women feel like they're not they don't have a romantic partner or they feel lonely or they're or not they don't what feel it? appreciated or right. that that appreciation yeah. is but, probably the most is more but, important but than love not like as important a sexual, sex, but also like a sexual being and I see a lot of patients who say you know my husband doesn't connect to me anymore I don't feel sexual and I really want to but I just I, think that's a convenient excuse that's, that absolutely. the public will easily digest for your excuse to go out and Seek Cheap. out the services of Ashley right. Madison. Well, Plus, I could have given a dud gift, like a mop or a toaster or something. Right. Hey, no, I'm, I'm, not, not, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not saying, saying you way. get a mop. We'll call <laughs> Ashley Madison. Let's go look I'm at a mop. That. I'm just saying you want to peel and, and understand the reasons why. It's not a justification, but people have reasons. It's not about You need to hear them. Very few men actually buy their spouse's gifts on Mother's Day. Like 24% or 23% is a small percentage. It's not about the gift. It's just feeling overlooked, no, no value, right. unappreciated for all the things that mom does all day long. And you can get a beautiful gift and not feel recognized. That's right. the reality. So what happens you can get to the beautiful man that gets the beautiful there? gifts that comes with the Tiffany bag and his wife's cheats Then why is there some special? No, what the heck is going on? I mean, can I get a gift receipt? I mean, come on. I mean, Did you buy can I take this thing back? I mean, come on. Maybe he should have gotten right? the mob. I don't know. <laughs> I mean, you mean uh, even with an expensive gift, you know, it's still a chance. Well, right, because it's not about the gift. It's about is this person meeting my needs is this person is this relationship what I imagined for myself all right before we go the investment pro here 21 billion dollars is there some way to make money on this that you like I think entrepreneurially I, what I've seen is I mean in the stock market is oh in the stock in the stock market I like Tiffany oh. here I think Tiffany would be a good buy I think romance is coming back you know what? I would, I would say Madison. Stanley Black and Decker and the yeah. reason is because women love hand tools from I do day. let's leave it I know oh, you do let's oh, leave it there stop. all right guys by the way